Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your weekend message for this coming weekend on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, August 23rd, 24th, and 25th, 2024. That's a lot of 20s. Uh, let's get started here. Yes, we are accepting $5 Friday. Uh, just let me know through email, debdoesreadings at gmail.com, your list of questions. You can have multiple uh, and they are only $5 a question. It is done through email only. Uh, that does give a description as well, a picture of each of the questions of your cards, okay? So if you're interested, just email me at that address and I'll get them done. That cutoff time for $5 Friday, of course, is at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So let's get started here. There's that belief system, not really sure if this person, somebody's coming in from the past with that six of cups, you're not really sure if they're, I can't really say those words, if they are full of, you know, monarchy. Uh, but yeah, they're making a decision to show the action here. They're not going to be overly aggressive. For some, you're not going to take them back. This is a, this is a case of, uh, you know, free will, free choice, you know. Uh, but you got the hand of the higher font facing, I clarified that, with the Six of Swords. You want nothing to do with them. You don't want to communicate because they're only trouble here because of the length of time, okay? And the indecisiveness to act sooner for a new start. That's quite interesting. So I feel like there's going to be an attempt here. Clarify. Where others, that's really interesting how they divided that energy here. For the outcome, you got the justice. Don't worry. I know I'm all over the place. I'll explain. Uh, but the justice that's doing the right thing, that's communication, bringing in the balance. And it's clarified by the four swords here and the two of cups. So let's review what we have learned. Uh, I feel first things first in regards to both situations. There's two situations going on. Meaning one's going to say yes, others are going to say no to this relationship. With the Six of Cups and the Hierophant, Hierophant clarified uh, with the hand showing the Six of Swords. Six of Swords is communication. It's straightening things out. But with that hand, Hierophant is a, is a relationship, a commitment. Somebody from your past, you don't want to know what they have to say to you. Okay, there's definitely a halt here. Uh, there is an opportunity to fix things, okay, because things were a little rocky road here. But I feel for those of you who do not want them back, are frustrated, and now you're supposed to put this work in after all the mental anguish and the long wait here. Seven of Wands, clarified by the Three of Pentacles, Eight of Wands here, and the Temperance underneath all that. That's a definite no, okay, for some. Where others, they're going to come in. There's a decision. Do I want to bring back this balance with them here? That's your decision to make. Basically, the ball is in your court, okay? If you want to swing away, swing away and say yes and receive that, you know, throw back out there and say, heck yeah, where others are going to chuck that ball right at them. <laughs> I like that comparison. Uh, but definitely, I feel that there's that option. It's definitely split. Uh, it's not a definite yes, definite no. We all have free, free, cho free will, free choice here. Uh, but apparently that saying drives my daughter nuts. I said it just like five minutes ago to her on the phone. She's like, I know, Mom, I know. <laughs> It's nice what she knows, you know, what she thinks that I'm going to say next. <laughs> but anyway, outcome is the justice. For those of you who are considering to take them back and not a straight out no, like the no part, you're not even going to answer the phone. You're not even going to respond to the texts if they are unblocked off your phone. Okay. But definitely they're going to find a way if they are, if they are blocked, they're going to find another means to get through to you and you're still going to ignore them. Okay. And I, and I get it. No judgment here. This is a judgment free zone. Uh, but yeah, but for others, I feel that you're definitely going to hear them out, calm the situation down and work on this relationship. So that is what I have for this coming weekend. It's very indecisive, you know, whatever floats your boat, literally. Okay. For this coming weekend, August 23rd until the 25th, 2024, don't forget about $5 Friday. 
let me know. Email me at debdoesreadings at gmail.com your questions and I'll get them done. Cutoff for that again is at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.